It's turned. Big Tesla scream. I waited a whole year to get this, so check it out, guys. It's a little fingerprinty already, but it is what it is. All right, I'll start it up. Ooh. I went and got the PX6 Tesla style screen made by Phoenix Automotive. Radio. It's nice. 10.4 inch. Still has the Q system. Let's me use my factory stereo controls still. So I got the volume, skip button, still can use all those. Yes, I'm in the CTSV Gen 3. Um, you can play YouTube on it. You can watch a video, do whatever you want. Yeah, I'll show that. It does work, do anything. So I can like, comment, subscribe. You guys can like, comment, subscribe. Hopefully you do to me, please. Um, what else we got? We got the console. The console is pretty much the Cadillac Q system. Um, really self-explanatory. It's Cadillac Q. You see, I got somebody calling me now. Still works. Uh, music is just like, I don't know. I got YouTube that hooks up to mine, but you could do Bluetooth if you wanted to. You still have the regular radio, which goes through the Cadillac Q system. Uh, what else? Video, mine hooks up to YouTube, or you could have hooked it up to a different, uh, I guess, player that you would like, movie system player. Settings is where you go to Wi-Fi to hook everything up. Um, that's where you kind of customize your default maps, which is Google Maps for the radio. I still have the Apple CarPlay dongle, which is in my glove compartment. Uh, it's a USB plug up. Um, what else? My default music player, my default video player, default radio, like I was talking about. Um, you can add Netflix and stuff like that, which I'm going to do. So there's a lot of things you can do. You still got a dimmer. I mean, it's a ton. It's really pretty much a, a tablet. Um, Self-explanatory. I got Google over here. I click that. I can go to Google. I can search whatever I want to search. Let's say I want to go there. Let's say I want to go to Jeff Schmidt. Let's go to my job. Uh, Jeff Schmidt. Let's say that right there. Cool. I mean, as you can see, everything works. You know what I mean? So, I mean, if you guys got any questions on hooking it up, I'll do a review video on how to hook it up, and I'll release the video and an installation video on how I did it. So, um, just like, comment, and subscribe. I mean, it's a pretty cool radio. Let's push allow on that. Everything works as it should. I'm still going through the kinks on it right now, getting it how I want, but over and all, it's pretty good radio. It was, uh, I think I paid $700 for it. So, it's an investment, definitely, but I think it's pretty much worth it. Uh, I got my home button right there. Uh, if you're wondering about the air and all that, uh, that is the air. It stays there no matter what. Um, and the top layer right there stays no matter what also, too, as well. This is the Cadillac Q screen again. If I wanted to bring my air up and do more to it, swipe up and bring it i still got heated seats because i got the curl seats in mine um if you have a regular cts or ats you might have the cool seats or a cts v that doesn't have the racing seats you might have the cool seats but for me i've heated that work um everything works as it should um but yeah that's it man it took me about 12 days to get it from china uh, I ordered it actually through Phoenix Automotive. Sometimes they have specials too, so go on there and look and see if they got a discount. But they do test it before they send it out also as well, so it goes through that. And that was pretty much it. 
I could tell it was tested because it was hooked up to a previous Wi-Fi. And also I was messaging the guy from Phoenix Automotive through email. And he told me that's why it takes so long once you order it because it's, they do test it. Um, but everything, the fitment is great. It looks shiny just like the rest of my plastic on my Cadillac. Um, easy hookup, self-explanatory. Um, the only hard thing was hooking it up through the glove compartment because you do have the dongle there that you'll have to hook up to your USB, but it's pretty simple and easy though. Uh, my installation video will go through all that. So uh, you guys just give me a like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks.